Of course, on the higher beam, we always want to have a spotter there to give the kids confidence and for safety. But we can always use the floor beams in our obstacle courses so that the kids can get a little bit more practice and just grow in their courage. So we've set up a couple of different drills here on the, on the floor beam. Bailey's going to walk across. We have letters on the floor, and we're going to have them walk across and without falling off the beam, touch one toe to each letter. Big arms. Okay, go ahead. Good job. This just helps them keep their center over the beam and reminds them that they're trying to keep those arms big and wide, that they're trying to not wiggle and to not wobble. Okay, Ireland, go ahead. Big arms. Good, touch the letters. Again, they're, they want to try to do it without falling off. Big arms, Ireland. And if you can remember to keep your arms like an airplane, that will help you stay balanced. Okay, one more. Big arms to Penga. Good job. Good job. Okay, the next thing we'll do is add bean bags. On the bean bags, we want them to do bunny hops over each one, landing with their feet side by side, and trying, of course, to stay on. Good job. Good job. Very nice. Okay, Ireland, go ahead. Keep those feet side by side. Good try. Keep your feet right together like a bunny. Good job. The last one was a good one. Okay, Topanga. The more drills we can set up closer to the floor, the more comfortable they'll become in doing beam. 